Good morning and welcome to Vario E-Learning. Um, Mr. Fortune, your music teacher, I hope you're staying safe and doing well at home. Um, today, we'll be talking about a very um, interesting topic. It's actually practical about the keyboard instrument. So we'll learn about the keyboard, we'll talk about how it produces sound, and then its importance, and then how to make sounds on it. So over here with me, I have my keyboard here. Um, as you can see on the keyboard, it has some series of white keys and black keys. Now the keyboard produces sound by pressing down the notes. Can you hear it? That when you want to press your finger on any note, it gives you the required sound you want. Also, a keyboard does just that it doesn't make um, one sound, it makes up to three, four, five, or six, depending on who's playing. It can produce two sounds by pressing two notes you have here. So it gives you two, three, four, five, six, and then even seven. So, um, as you can see on the keyboard, it has some sets of black keys which are arranged in groups. Um, looking down here, we have um, the group of two black keys, a group of three black keys, it continues like that. Like that. Um, alternatively, two, three, after three, we have the same two again, three, two, three, two, three, two, and three. Okay, now um, we'll talk about the importance of the keyboard. Why is it very important that we use the keyboard instrument. So, um, we have something on the board here. What I said earlier is on the board. The keyboard has white and black keys. As you already said, the keyboard produces sound whenever the white and black keys are pressed to the fingers. So whenever you strike this piece to your fingers, the sound comes out. Now, the black keys are arranged in group of twos. We have twos here. Like the same thing you saw on the piano. The two black keys and then in threes also, three black keys. So here is the importance of the keyboard instrument. One, the keyboard is used in music making. Okay, it's used in making music. Um, let me play a music kind of piece for you to hear how the keyboard is being used in making music. Okay, that's it. Use it to make music. And then um, number two says it has many types of sound for music making. Okay, now the first sound I use is called the piano sound, the grand piano sound. Now we could use different other sounds. Um, the piano sound sounds like this. We could use, let's say, um, the um, trumpet sound. Let's program the trumpet sound. It sounds like a trumpet now, okay? Now we could use, um, let's say, the, um, um, the organ sound. It could sound like an organ. Different kind of organ. Okay, so with this you can make a different kind of music depending on what you want to sound like. Now number three says it, produ it provides accompaniment to other instruments. It provides accomp accompaniment is it, it provides a kind of a support, harmonic support. Okay, it, it supports other instruments when they are making performances. The instrument could be the violin, the saxophone, the trumpet, even your voice is an instrument. Um, assuming you you want to um, accompany a singer, let's say someone is singing the national anthem, the keyboard can be used to accompany the person. Let's say, um, so with that, you could use the keyboard to accompany any kind of music with any kind of instrument. So um, at this point, we'll take um, assignments 
and we end the class. Okay, now this is your assignment on the board. Explain how sound is produced on the keyboard. You're going to tell me how sound is being produced on the keyboard. Number two says the black keys are arranged in groups of dash and dash. We talked about the arrangement of black keys. They are arranged in groups. So tell me what kind of groups. In groups of dash and dash, okay? The last one says the keyboard instrument has dash and dash types of keys. You can tell me what and what kind of keys the keyboard has. So um, I'll play just a short song and then I will come to the end of the class. Okay. Okay, so at this point we've come to the end of our class for today.